Third time's a charm, maybe? I don't know. I just hate my... I just... I just hate how I set up this sometimes. Anyways, welcome to another exciting edition. Of course, it is Wednesday. It is Hope Day! Wait, I'm not the Geico Camel. And today, of course, you, everyone knows me now. In these episodes called Chef Boy SG. Of course, y'all like my cooking, don't you? You wish you could eat it all day. Stuff your face. We are going to be making cinnamon roll poke cake. I mean, the recipe says cinnamon dream poke cake, but looking on the rest, looking on the uh, website, uh, they have it as cinnamon roll poke cake. Now the cake part. <laughs> you will need one of these vanilla cake mix, and it'll tell you your ingredients right here on the back of the box which I did correctly. I was going to say, hopefully it's... Do not eat raw cake batter. Well, too fucking bad. And with I used a 9 by 13 uh, pan. And it'll be cooking for about 30 to 35 minutes in the oven at 350 degrees. Now for the filling part. Once it cools down, I poke holes in it about half an inch each... each uh, about half an inch apart each one. Now for the filling. Five, five tablespoons of softened butter. Half a cup of light brown sugar. Packed, of course. So I have a uh, magnet for a cool and we put it away. Next, we only need three, te three teaspoons. <laughs> Cinnamon. Now if I could just find my teaspoon thingy. Oh well, too fucking bad, we'll just have to use this. One. Two and three. I have there's not much left in there, so good. I have an extra one just in case, and I don't need it. Two and a half teaspoons of vanilla. It says clear vanilla, but you can use regular vanilla if needed. One. And one can of sweetened condensed milk. Of course, I got to get my egg beaters out. This is the middle part of the cake. I don't need those big spoons. I just need a small one just to get in here and get the rest of the frickin' Similar to when I had the Butterfinger poke cake. Come on. Hey, every little bit helps. A little bit of drop helps, so... Okay. 
where are my egg beaters? Found them! <laughs> are we in, kids? We're actually going to microwave this for about 45 seconds. After we beat it up a little bit. Gonna beat it! This is the filling part. I gotta let the cake, as you can see in here, it is cooking. I gotta let that rise. This goes in the microwave for the filling and that it will go in the fridge for a little bit. And then we make the frosting for top. So part one is done. If you like what you see, hit that like and subscribe button for more, more cooking and baking videos, of course. I got plenty to do. I want to do some gingerbread fudge and some others. But for now, cinnamon roll poke cake, part one. Enjoy and stay hungry, everyone.